This is the dark, brooding, mysterious film by Adam McGoyan about a school bus that slides off the road and falls through the ice and about how a lawyer who has troubles of his own slowly penetrates the secrets of the people he wants to use as witnesses. The lawyer is played in a great performance by Ian Holm. In a flashback, we see two of the parents in a snowbound Canadian town taking their child to the doomed school bus. Beautiful snow we're having, eh, Dolores? Oh, it's just a flurry hardly. It's totally clear up ahead. The parents are played there by Arsene Kanjian and Earl Pasco, and the lawyer has a strained conversation with them after the death of their son. If everyone had done their job with integrity, your son would be alive and safely in school this morning. I promise that I will pursue and reveal who it was who did not do their job. The Sweet Hereafter follows the lawyer on his journey through the secrets of the town, but this is not a movie about courtrooms or investigations. It's about sadness, about how a tragedy occurred, and no one can make sense of it or find an appropriate way to react to it, except for one girl who, in a stunning scene, reduces everything to an issue in her own life. The Sweet Hereafter won the grand prize at Cannes this year, and I agree, it's one of the year's best films. Nothing worse than losing a child. It's life out of order. People, we all know, uh, sadly, people never adjust to this. Mm -hmm. To take on that subject matter and to find some peace, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. some meaning in this thing that has no meaning mm -hmm. is a spectacular achievement. It's so original, and a lot of the credit should go to Russell Banks, the author of the novel. It's interesting that the lawyer is not seen as an ambulance-chasing fee grabber, but as no. a guy who almost finds himself in the same mood as the people he comes to this town to represent, so that they're all wondering in kind of a, a frigid northern mist of grief and confusion. Here the emotional blood is there, and the healing process somehow does begin.